Adam Furstein, Celgene is expected to be a hot biotech stock next week. Tell me what's going on. Yeah, uh, next Friday, January 25th, uh, Celgene researchers are going to be presenting results from a phase three study of the company's drug, Abraxane, in pancreatic cancer. Uh, now, back in November, Celgene announced that the Abrax that Abraxane met the goal uh, of the study, which was to prolong the survival of pancreatic cancer patients. Um, but details were reserved for presentation at a medical meeting, and that's what's going to be taking place on, on Friday. So how important is Abraxane to Celgene's growth, and you know, what will adding pancreatic cancer to the drug's label mean for sales? You know, historically, at least for the past several years, Celgene's growth has been driven primarily by its multiple myeloma drug Revlimid. Now, what's changed for Celgene today, and for the better, is more diversified growth from an array of cancer drugs. Now, Braxane is a big part of the equation now. 2012 sales of around $400 million, mainly in breast cancer, are expected to reach $1 billion to $1.25 billion in 2015, you know, with pancreatic cancer accounting for much of that increase. Well, speaking of growth, Celgene shares are up almost 40% since the announcement of the positive Abraxane results in pancreatic cancer. So it seems like investors see this as a positive. Yeah, yeah, definitely it is. Uh, you know, and most of, most of those Celgene stock gains have come since uh, December 31st, since the end of the year. Um, I think 2013 is seen by many investors as the start of a new era of accelerated growth for Celgene, uh, which explains why the stock is performing so well. Uh, at last week's J.P. Morgan Healthcare Conference, uh, Celgene for the first time gave long-range 2017 guidance that called for revenue of about $12 billion and earnings per share of 13 to $14. You know, investors took this as a very confident sign. All right, so getting back to Friday's Abraxane data presentation, what sort of result will be viewed positively by Wall Street? You know, right now I think consensus uh, among Wall Street is, is for uh, a two- to three-month survival advantage for Abraxane over control in this pancreatic cancer trial.